These are Venones harvestmen. Venones ornata is the genus and the species. They fluoresce under black light, under UV light, and that's the reason for this sort of purple glow. I've got a black light flashlight that I'm shining on them. And parts of their body fluoresce very nicely, those yellowish portions. A little bit later in the video, you'll get to see these things under normal light. You can also see a little bit of pink fluorescence in this video. I used to have some really great background music as part of this video, but can't upload that in YouTube anymore. You get my voice instead. See some springtails crawling around there? A couple different organisms living in the tank with these. They feed really well on carrot in captivity. I also feed them fish food pellets. But there are some other small organisms in the tank, like mites and springtails and some dwarf isopods that they probably scavenge on, maybe even capture alive. I've seen them eat fruit flies before, actually. Species does really well in captivity, live for a couple years, and they actually reproduce pretty well as well. There's a good sized one. Not quite an adult, I don't think. I think that one is maybe one molt back. Um, just crawling around the cage there in, in the uh, normal coloration, in normal light. And in this scene here, you can see a few that have tucked themselves into some egg crates that I've flipped over for the purpose of the video. Probably shot this video about hmm, eight years ago. See a little bit of mold there. And you also see the baby harvestmen. These are related to daddy long legs. They do much better in captivity though. And you see some parental behavior there perhaps. Touching of the antennae, communication at the arachnid level. Speaking of arachnids, there's a few mites crawling around there, sort of out of focus on the left. Mites aren't always a threat in tanks. There's a lot of people freaking out about them all the time, but they're not really too much of a concern. It sort of depends on what kind of mites they are and whether they are accumulating on the animal or not. But these are probably performing some cleanup duties and may even serve as food for some of the bioactive animals in the tank. The whole setup is pretty bioactive. There goes a springtail. Came into focus there for just a moment. Beautiful animal.